Yeah, what's up, guys? Gonna do a uh, quick little tour here. Uh, pretty much got this set sorted, I think. Um, probably definitely could use some fine tuning. Uh, but I took more, I went all the way down on the rear springs compared to the race prep video. Uh, just really seemed to help out in a couple different spots. But uh, let's go through the track. So I let third gear run it out there and then go down to first. Kind of late apex for that corner. And second gear and then I just let it run out again. You want to get as close to that curb as you can, then get on throttle as soon as you can. Up to third gear. I like to just dab the brakes a little bit to get that nose to turn in so then we can get on the gas a little bit sooner. If you don't do that, it tends to uh, push out. And then stay in third through there. I didn't mean to shift down to second. You stay in third all the way through here. Get as much of that gray curb as you can. Then fourth, and then you just aim for the tree on the right, right in front of us. And when it pops up over the ridge, you just aim for the tree furthest on the right. And then down to second gear, and that will give you a straight line through as you came. Through second gear through there. Up through, uh, I just keep it in fifth up here. And what I've been doing lately is kind of just coasting. Slowly getting on the brakes, and then once it gets in here, then getting really heavy on the brakes. It looks like I did nick that uh, pit wall a little bit. I don't think it damaged the car, though. Pretty much breaking where that curb starts. Down to first gear. Just wrap around the last part of that curb. Again, let it just run out in second. Get as close as curb as you can, then just get on the throttle. Third. Again, off a little bit. Just let the brakes get that front end to just turn in right there so you can get back on like that. And then be real patient with this corner early on the brakes. Just like that. Get a nice run off the corner. Come down through here. Get a little bit of that. Ah, that was a little ugly. I got in the gas too soon. And then again, aiming for that tree on the right. The, um, before you get over the ridge, you can only see like one group, or you can see two groups of trees. The second group of trees is the trees I'm talking about. I'll tell you about it. This up, I'll stop and point it out. Point out my race prep video, but it's kind of buried in the middle of it. So, so yeah, it's pretty much a lap here. So again, back down to first gear. First or second there, it's, I guess it's whatever you're comfortable with. I like first. Kind of went to fourth there. I mean, you can do that again if you want to, but usually I like to let it just run out. Like I like to run in here so I don't have to shift back down. And get that nose to turn. Just just with a little bit with the brakes, same with here, just a little bit with the brakes to get that nose to turn. Same for that tree right in front of us there on the far right of that bunch. That's the ticket. You can attack that corner pretty good. The car's really stable through there. And I'm just going to leave it in fifth gear. A little dab of the brakes and then getting heavy on the brakes at the end. Kind of want to lift when you're going through the king on the brakes because that's where it'll unsettle the car. If you're too hard on the brakes through there. So I accidentally went to third there. I'd just rather stay in second, but again, that's it's all up to you. It's whatever, whatever you guys want to do. Whenever it feels more comfortable for you. It's just more comfortable for me to shift less times. There we go, that's much better. And you see that group of trees, aim for the one on the right. And you'll be right on line to go over the uh, next apex for the chicane. And the car just has great feel through that corner. Alright, so I'll run a couple more laps, but that's uh, pretty much the idea. Not too much speed. And be real patient up at the top of the hill here. The harder you push, the slower you'll go, in my opinion. At least how my car's set up.
I'd say I got through there really good that time. I was a little bit more warmed up. Probably could have slowed down a little bit more on the at the end and got better. Uh, actually hit the apex, but initial braking was really good. Again, I was kind of all over the place on gears there. That wasn't on purpose. I just kind of happened. Force my way through that one. The car, pretty controllable. It's kind of Florida and saw what it would do, and it was rather easy to understand what the car wanted to do and how to counter it. Alright, I can tell my focus is leaving me, so I I'll just leave it at that. I have a little romp here. Back in the day, if you uh, did this in an SRF when this uh, first came out, you could uh, cut and not get the slow down. <laughs> they fixed it now, but they uh Yeah. So hard to get the rear to slide on this car. All right, back. Get that rhythm again. All right, bud, bring it back in here right now. Oh, oh. <laughs> that I almost had it. All right, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the tour, and I'll see you next time.